Chapter 3, The Market. Thinking about you, hopefully this whole house thing won't be too complicated. I can manage. I need to be clever. This cat knows this place better than I do. Like a professional gardener. This place. I remember this place. What a lovely little spot. I spy a hungry little kitty. I scare her off, she could disappear for days. A bit of food might do the trick. I'm sure Grandma has something for you in her kitchen. This tree looks like it can keep a secret. I saw the cat treats in there, so I already know where they are. Okay, need to find something to attract my little friend. Wait a minute, there's something on the fridge now too, guys. Don't push yourself too hard. As your therapist said, you can't save everyone, little hobbit. Stop calling me a hobbit, you orc. You've collected sardines. Sardines, cats love these. Or is that a stereotype? That was not there earlier. That is a little bit weird. All right, speed reading, here we go. Dear Nora and Edward, I hope you won't mind me sending you this letter. Edward and I studied together for years before we parted ways, and I'm proud to call myself a friend of your family. As you requested, I met with Fabrice and discussed his military ambitions. I was extremely surprised to see how much he has changed over the years from the quiet little boy he was into he was into the complex young man he is now. His academic record and results are solid, but I have my doubts that the military school he has applied for is best suited to his current state of mind. May I suggest the Boy Scouts are a place where you can focus on empathy and community? Take care of yourselves. I hope to visit your delightful house in Dordogne soon. Mark. You've collected store-bought treats. Industrial treats never opened. Nora wouldn't have used these. Not sure if I have enough for my little friend to choose from. Oh, I sound just like a cat lady. Ooh. Oh, that you know what? There's cat food in here, yeah. My first studio flat in Paris was smaller than this pantry. You've collected homemade treats. Homemade cat food? That's just like Nora. It smells weird. I should have enough treats for the cat. I need to get back to the pond. A 
I hope the cat's still hungry. I mean, what? Hello, you. Um. Uh. Nope, not a sardine kind of cat. Okay. What do you mean? The cat is hungry. A cat of great taste, I see. Oh no, it got scared. I'll wait a bit longer. Uh. Oh no, it got scared. I'll wait a bit longer. Oh my gosh. You've collected the key. <clears throat> it's time to open this cave. What do you mean? You don't want to go to the cave. That's a horrible idea. When I say a horrible idea, I can't be more stressed on it like I have to, you know like when I say a horrible idea I mean a horrible I hope the key fits I kind of hope it doesn't oh this is dumb caves are bad Yes, I'm in. There's a kayak. Wait, it rings a bell. You're up. I was going to do some gardening. Will you help me? Sure. I guess. What's in that room? Nothing you'd be interested in. Get dressed and meet me outside. And brush those teeth. Yuck. <sighs>
first week's already gone. Time flies. Where am I supposed to get dressed at? Maybe I'm supposed to brush my teeth first. That's it. This is great. Ah, oh, that's where my clothes are. I gotcha. Oh, man. I almost forgot my hat. She's having fun now, ain't she? I'm done. That house. How did I feel about it? I used to come, but... But something... My father and his mother became more distant. I did notice it back then. I felt that something was wrong. And they never spoke about it. Is that why I don't remember that summer? I feel like I'm missing a word somewhere. No cookies, just weird stuff I've never heard about. sure if you really wanted to help. I, I don't know anything about gardening. Then we'll start with something easy. Why don't you go and fetch a trowel from the cave? You got what I need. Oh, Yo, Josh J.P. Pepper, thank you for the raid. Appreciate it, man. I hope you're doing well tonight, Josh. How was your stream, my friend? How was your stream? A trowel? Haha, <laughs> don't worry. It's like a small shovel. You can't miss it. Find the trowel in the cave. Hmm, with Grandpa, we used to do puzzles out there. We are playing a game called Dordonia tonight. It's pretty cool so far. You collected a new sticker. Thank you, Josh. I appreciate it, man. Beautiful. Good night to you as well. Thank you, thank you, thank you, man. You collected a new sticker. Yeah, 
It could be a nice place to read all these boring books I have to read. I love how literally nothing changes here, dude. If you're coming in from Josh's stream, I appreciate y'all being here. The weird noises I hear at night, it's probably this tree. This is a, a game from an independent studio. I wish that I could be like the cool kids. Hi, Boston and Room. Hello, Dovo. Thank you for the 37 months. I appreciate the continued support. You've collected a new tape. So, <clears throat> ladies and gentlemen, the train will soon leave the platform. Honey, do you know where my... What are you doing? I'm... I'm recording a message. For the train. Oh, that's a great idea. Why are you looking like I'm catching you cheating on me? I... I don't know. It, it felt... Silly to do it. Edouard, my love. Everything we do is silly. You run a toy train. I sketch impossible buildings. It's called retirement. No, it's not exactly retirement. and You know it. <laughs> to me it is. Finally spending time with my husband and my son. What were you looking for? My fountain pen. Your... The one in your front pocket? My front po Oh. Uh, yes, that one. <laughs> Double, I hope you're doing well, man. I appreciate it very much. Let's see the train. Grandma was right. It looks like a small shovel. You collected a new sticker. Just get home and about to eat. Wow, a kayak. Cool. Mimi, did you find the trowel? Yes, coming. So what's on the on the what's 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 for dinner this evening, Doble? You took your time. Are you all right? You have a kayak? Yes, it belonged to your dad, but it's broken. Oh, oh no. I wish I could go kayaking. Let's concentrate on gardening today, all right? I need you to pull out the weeds. Yeah, yeah. So dad had a kayak? Yes, he did. Your grandfather and your father used to kayak back in the day. Well, your father never really liked it. Oh, okay. How did the kayak break? It smashed into some rocks on a day the Dordogne was really rough. Smashed? So cool. Can we fix the kayak? I'd have to think about it. Ah. Uh... Mmm, yummy. 
I think I've finished. Now let's plant something, shall we? Really? Of course. First, we dig a hole using the trowel. Then let's choose a plant. Which one do you fancy? A neighbor gave me a cutting from his rose bush. August is the best time for planting. The rose, it has thorns, but it will be beautiful one day. Let's plant the flower then. Remove the pot. Now we fill the hole with soil and make a little mountain to keep the plant stable. <laughs> Wonderful job, Mimi. To grow, a plant needs sun, time, and water. Exactly. When you plant something, you need to water it a lot. collected a new sticker. Excellent work. I was thinking, I need to get some things from the market. And there we could buy things to fix the kayak. What do you think? Yeah. I mean, is it fixable? Oh, yes. We would need a certain kind of glue. A waterproof one. Maybe some wood to fix the holes. Hmm. Can we really do it? Yes, we can. Yeah. So, what are we waiting for? <laughs> we left the house. We walked together. What a journey it was. Go to the market with Grandma. I have to go back down, back down to the river.
Yep. Nora spoke about her life, about her travels. There was always a part of her that belonged somewhere else. I liked her. I can say it now. I loved that woman. So smart, so charming. And yes, sometimes her eyes looked sad. I've unlocked a new location. Waterfall. Dad used to say that I looked just like Nora when I was daydreaming. He hated that, of course. He disliked his mother and never explained why. Unlocked a new location. Market. Welcome to the market, my dear. So many people. It's crazy. I've told you before, we don't say crazy. But yes, it's crowded. Here, I wrote down what we need to buy. Would you like to take care of that? Me? But Mum never lets me shop by myself. She says it's too dangerous. I trust you. You're 12. I won't be far away. I'm just going to say hello to some old friends. Cool. I'll be back with everything soon. Oh my gosh. I'm in big trouble. Get, please. Sure, here you go. Thank you. You're so polite. Have a great day. Okay. You've collected a baguette. Damn right I have. Thank you. 
has cheese, butter, but no milk. Hello, do you have any milk left? I should have some right here. Oh, it's gone. It must be that damned kid. Which kid? There's a thief around here and he keeps whistling. It's driving everyone mad. Or you. You collected a new sticker. You've collected a new sticker. You've collected a new tape. Oh, you're in a jolly mood today. I've been remembering our trip to New York. The Empire State Building and all that. Uh, that was a nice break from here. You couldn't stop thinking about your garden and the flowers. Yes, I could. I... You know, maybe I did a little. I wish Fabrice could have come with us. He loves the state so much. Spending two weeks with his parents in a small hotel room in Brooklyn was probably not his dream holiday. Well, it saved us from a couple of arguments, and... Uh... What? No, nothing. I... I was just thinking that I missed him. Even if he does have your personality. Oh, yes, he... Way, what are you implying? Nothing. <laughs> Come back here. Hello? Hi! My grandma and I need some waterproof glue. And also some pieces of wood. We're fixing a kayak. Oh, I'm so sorry, you're too late. The last tube I had was pilfered a few minutes ago. P pilfered? Yeah, stolen! I'm sure it's that little rascal. A kid your age. A ripe little pest, if you ask me. Oh, okay. Thank you. I'm gonna kill this little kid. some rhubarb, but I'm not sure what it looks like. Those branches over there, is it for a pie or jam? <laughs> I, I don't know. My grandma just said rhubarb. You'd better take the green and the red ones then. Don't let them sit around too long before you eat them. Anything else? No, that's all. Have a great day, little lady. Gosh, my hands.
Oh no, uh uh. Collected a new sticker. Hello. Good morning. Hello, sweetie. What can I do for you? We need tomato seeds. You're Nora's granddaughter, aren't you? Yes, I am. So nice to meet you. I think these are the seeds she wants. Thank you so much. Okay. No milk, no glue. Oh, I should go back to Grandma. You got a cool new sticker. You collected a new sticker. Do you have everything? Almost. I haven't got milk. We can get milk somewhere else, or glue, or wood. Oh, Mimi. Some kid stole everything. A kid? Maybe he's still here. What do you know about our little thief? He whistles. That's the only thing I know. All right, let's find him, shall we? I... Yes. Yes! I need to take a picture of him. Quick, Mimi. Got him! Look! You scared the thief. He dropped his bag. Yes, he did. Wow! Everything he stole is in it! Funny. Now that I think about it, it's like she knew who the thief was. Why don't you take back all the stolen stuff? I'm sure the sellers will be pleased. Good idea! Thank you, Mimi! Well done, Mimi. Let's head home now. I remember now how good it felt. Helping other people, giving up my time for them. How come I'd forgotten all that? And that one? That's not a star. Look how fast it's moving. It's a satellite. Wow. And the big blue star over there? Ah, that's Sirius. The brightest star we can see. Just like you. Ah, <laughs> I'm not a star. Almost. Tell me, how was it today? How do you feel? Awesome. Today was awesome, but tomorrow we'll fix the kayak. And I can't wait. I don't blame you. That kayak, it's going to be awesome. We'll fix it first thing tomorrow. I'm so glad we managed to stop that thief. You and your camera, you're like a proper reporter. So... The first half of your holidays is over. I'm sure the second half will be even better. I know it will. What's wrong, Mimi? Are you worried about something? No, no, just thinking about the thief. I wonder if he was forced to steal or if it was just a game. Ah, well, that's another mystery to solve for Mimi, the brilliant reporter. I'm not a reporter. That binder of yours is like a newspaper, right? Hmm, okay. Maybe you're right. By the way, time to do my page.
Hell yeah. 